What's up guys, Buckling1 here and welcome to my 12th Battlefield Hardline Weapon Guide. Today we'll be taking a look at the first operator weapon, the Oro 933. The Oro 933 is known in real life as the CAR-15 Commando or the M4 and is designed and manufactured by the American arms manufacturer Colt Defense. The Commando is most famous for its extensive use by the American forces in the Vietnam War. The Oro 933 is the first weapon available for the Operator class and is available for both the law enforcement and criminal factions. It comes equipped by default with a red dot sight, flash hider and stubby grip. The max damage for the Oro 933 is 20 which drops off to a minimum of 12 after 50 meters, meaning you will need a minimum of 5 bullets to kill up close and up to 9 bullets to kill at range. Rate of fire is one of the highest in this class, coming in at 850 rounds per minute, which is key strength for the carbine. The high fire rate does mean that the Oro 933 has some significant disadvantages, which we'll refer to soon. Reloading the Oro 933 takes 2.3 seconds with a bullet left in the chamber, and when the magazine is empty it will take 2.7 seconds for a full reload. These are among the lowest reload times in the carbine class. Recoil is the Achilles heel of the Oro 933. It will drift hard up and to the right and I feel that it can be hard to control even when top firing. The recoil up value is 0.32 and the recoil right value is 0.3. Pair this with a first shot multiplier of 2.8 and you can begin to understand why this weapon is so hard to control. Personally, I had a very hard time trying to get some decent footage while using the Oro 933 and I was very nearly not going to make this video because of it. I was very put off by the fact that almost every other weapon could dominate me, as it felt like the bullets I was shooting weren't connecting, whether up close or from a distance. Strangely, I started to have a much better time with the Oro 933 when I took the red dot sight off and just left the iron sights on the weapon. I'm not sure if this is a bug or not, but it did seem very odd to me. I also switched up the stubby grip to an angle foregrip which seemed to help as well. Overall, I don't really rate the Oro 933, so I give it a 2 star rating. I think the rate of fire is too high, and when coupled with the insane recoil traits that it has, it's just not a very fun weapon to use. If you are going to use it or are just starting off and have no choice, I really recommend using just the iron sights, they seem to make the weapon that bit more manageable. This is the first weapon so far that I've not really enjoyed using, which is not necessarily a bad thing, it's just not for me considering that the M416 just beats the R0933 in almost every performance aspect, but I'll cover that in another video. What do you guys think of the R0933? Have you used it so far and have you liked it or do you think it's not that great? Let me know in the comment section below. Also, make sure to leave a like if you enjoyed this video and make sure you subscribe by clicking the button on screen now to see my future weapon guide videos, which will add to a playlist as well to make it easier to watch. Links also on screen now and in the description. This has been Buckling1, thanks so much for watching guys, and I'll see you in my next video.